Come, 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 come on! Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, people of the world, I'm here to do a review of... Starring my cat. And he's here because most people who like this kind of anime seem to love cute little furry things like him. Now, cat, sissy, what are you doing? Stay there. What did you think of the film? Personally, yeah, that's it. That's exactly what I thought of the film too. Now, we grew up with things like Ghost in the Shell, Akira, Pat Labor, Ninja Scroll, Fist of the North Star, and when it comes to the family-friendly animes, there are ones like Ghibli films. Now, me and Sooty here, we thought was unbelievably depressing, unnecessarily so, wasn't very good, started really well, and then it just became basically a struggle. It became anguish. It became quite painful sitting in the cinema. It was like trying to make you as depressed as possible. And I reckon it probably was saying something about maybe Japanese culture because there's a lot of suicide unfortunately in Japan which is a real shame because they often put out such beautiful beautiful works especially when it comes to animation. But Sooty agrees with me, don't you? was not classic anime, not classic manga, just really depressing. Also, I thought that the main guy in the film kind of acted like a girl, and I realised after the film finished that it was directed by a woman, and I thought maybe that has something to do with it. He was very feminine. You agree, don't you? You think so as well? Yeah, he agrees with me, Sooty so does. Anyway, we're gonna go now. <laughs> You look hilarious. Alright, I'll let him down next time. I let you down, didn't I? Be glad I didn't put you down, you pain in the arse. Anyway, the cat didn't work. It certainly wasn't classic manga. The boy seemed like a girl. It was depressing, it was miserable, I felt worse coming out of the cinema than I felt going in. That is not the sign of a good movie, not for me anyway, but if you really want to feel depressed, if you really want an excuse to slit your wrists, if you're really, really desperate to throw yourself off the top of a building, if you can't wait to jump in front of moving traffic on a motorway, if you really, really wish that you had never been born, if you wish that you never had any breath in your lungs, if you regret the fact that you're are alive in this wonderful, mystical, mysterious world and universe that stretches on forever and ever, mysteriously, unexplainably, then, you know, go and watch this movie because it's perfect for you. I am George. Take care of yourselves. Peace.